This is uh, Warren again, Tuppence TV. I've got the uh, wonderful author, Sean Hudson, with me. Thank you, thank you. He's right, I am wonderful. He is wonderful. He's give me a bag of chips for that. <laughs> <laughs> I've, got, I've, got, I've got some M&Ms in me, but I'll give you one. Oh, that'll do better. You Have you got proof? <laughs> no, no. He's not lying yet. as well. Yeah, not yet. Go, I've eaten them. Get on with the interview. It's supposed to be a professional. Get on with it. Sean, so how would you describe your novels? Because how long have you been doing it? Oh, gee, uh, over 30 years now. Yeah, over, yeah, yeah. over the end. I still haven't got the hang of it. Yeah, well over no. 30 years. Um, yeah, that actually, Chase, the brand new one, uh, is, um, is the 38th novel that I've had published under my own name. I've done another 30 under different pseudonyms over the years. Six that different pseudonyms. Crap, or? Uh, yeah. Um, <laughs> one of those pseudonyms, obviously, was J.K. Rowling. Yeah, I know. But, I did uh, them as well. Yeah, exactly. There you go. What can you do? But, you know, people like them, they seem to. I know. But, uh, yeah, no, it's, just, it's just stuff that's, you know, dredged up from the deep, dark <laughs> recesses of my mind and basically uses therapy. It's... So were you bullied as a child? No, and I wish no. I had been. There'd have been more fucking material. <laughs> There, mate. I'll tell you, no, it's like everybody says, did you open the wrong door at the wrong time when you were a kid? I'm like, no, I had a really boring <laughs> upbringing. I have no excuse for the fucking state of the what stuff is, that I write. What is the chase about then? Oh, I haven't got a clue. I wrote it a year ago. <laughs> Ask me another one. Uh, no, it's, it's about a couple, um, they're about to go on a, on a holiday in America in a, uh, an RV. They've got an eight-year-old daughter. Then they discover that, she, that there's kids in that area of America that are being killed by a cult. Anyway, it's all sick and twisted and disgusting and it's very gripping and it's nice. You'll like it. I will. I love cults and all that stuff. Well, there like. you go, mate. Excellent. Somebody called me a cult the other day. I think it was a cult, <laughs> didn't it? I could be wrong. So, which book of yours has got the most pages? Do you know? I thought you were going to say which is the most deep, which is the most deep and, and well. You already told me you don't do deep. The most pages, probably <laughs> Renegades. No, I don't do deep. I've just, I've just finished, I've just finished one that's 600 pages long. Is that your longest? That's the longest one I've ever done. Yeah. Why was that? You just have. I just couldn't stop. It was, <laughs> I, I ran out of it. I haven't got a clue how to finish the bloody thing. It's like I'll keep going. Same with Latin. You, is that finished then? That one? Yeah, that's done now. That comes out in Ardbeck next year. Um, What's that called? That's called Testament, and Testament. that's the, that's a sequel to Renegades, and that's 30 years ago. 30 years ago. It's a bit like Jurassic Park. So did you have to read problem. Renegades again to remind yourself what yes, happened in the first Yes, I did. One. That was very embarrassing. Yeah, I had to go right through it going, God, I really wish I hadn't done that, and I wish I'd done that better. Yeah, I had to go back and read Are it. Are you going to re-release Renegades then? Or, I mean, yeah, that, that, obviously all yeah, that's that, anyway, well, um, White Ghost, which is the second one that had Sean Doyle in that character, that's right. being re-released this year, and then a year after it'll be uh, the re-release of Knife Edge is due to happen. So, yeah, it's all to tie in with it. Have you... I know you some you change some of them into screenplays as well, don't you? Yeah, I've just I've just finished the script for uh, Chase, and I've just finished the script for Assassin, which originally was set in London, but I've had to move to New York, so yeah. it's just a matter of hoping now that they'll get made because it's a bit of a lottery. Well, once you I, have you had any films? Have you, have you had any films made? Well, in the past, Slugs. Or? But oh, I don't slugs. know if you can actually count that. Um, <laughs> you know, Italian actors, uh, French director, shot in Spain, never win anything at Cannes, might get something at the United Nations. What can I say? <laughs> Awesome. But it's all right. It's not that bad. Cool. Well, lovely to talk to you, Sean. My pleasure. Thank you. Cheers, Brilliant, mate. Take care, mate. <laughs>